What is up guys? Uh, back with another video today. It's gonna be a little bit different of a video. Um, I'm actually down in the Miami area, like uh, Kendall uh, area. Actually, I'm not 100% sure. I'll let you know like when we get the GoPro on. But we're going to be doing some urban, I thought that was a big snake, some urban bridge fishing. And we're gonna be using live shiners. We got a nice pen rod here that I actually have to set up. Good thing I looked at that. And then I also got one of these jigs. As you can tell, the Gulfstream jigs. I actually use these a lot back home in Stewart. Uh, bigger, of course, bridge fishing for big snook and everything, but these work really well for peacock bass. So right in front of me here is the bridge and this little canal, I'm gonna put glasses on, got the live bait, we're gonna go under there. Hopefully there's no homeless people sitting under there. Is that a peacock already? No, it's a turtle, I was gonna say. Anyways, let's get everything rigged up and jump to the GoPro right now. Okay, so I've just pulled up to the spot here and as you guys can tell, we will be literally fishing under this bridge. Um, so I don't know exactly how we're gonna do this, boys, but that is the art of fishing, correct? Look how clear this water is. It's insane. Got a duck under here. Please don't fall, please don't fall. I'm slightly just moving on through here. I'm really just focused on not falling. Ooh, I feel like some, something just came up in here right there. Oh my God, I scared that. Whew. That was scary. It's crazy. It's very dirty though. What is that? That's a pee right there. That is a pee right there. I see him. I see him literally right here. Come on, eat it. No, there he goes. He's turning away from it. Look at him, look at him. That's a big one. He's going after it. Look at him. He's right there. He's looking at it. He's on it. Oh, he popped it. He was on it too, boys. Look at that little one. Dang. He was on it too. I'm gonna have to run up under here. What the heck? Look at him, he's on it, he's on it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. No, he dropped it. He pulled the hook. Okay, so we got the bait. Whew, that was a workout. There it is. Not even a workout, just balance, dude. Whew. So many spurs. There we go. There we go, boys. Peacock bass. Let's go. Look at that. All right, so we're back in action here. Just live baiting it to like the edge of these rocks, sort of. This is crazy. I'm trying to get a big one though. Like a nice size on. Oh my God. I think we can consider that a big boy. Look at him right there. Oh, I spooked him. Maybe, but he's kind of swimming towards him. He's right there. 
He's on him. He's got him. He's got him. He's got him. He ate right there. Oh my god. That's a beautiful one. That's the one I'm looking for. Look at that. That is a beautiful peacock bass. And he ate right at the shore. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know if that's Graham pick. Oh my god. Such a pretty fish. Such a pretty fish. He's gonna... Look at that. He's going for it again. Ow. Beautiful fish. Beautiful fish, boys. He caught him right here, too. See you, bud. Poke me. All right, sorry for that loud honking and of course all this bridge noise here, but there's nothing you can do about it. This is just too good. That peacock ate right there. Yes, sir. Little one. Damn. Little baby peacock bass. Because that little baby peacock was a little too gut hooked. Um, that's really sad, honestly. I hate to see that. There's another peacock under this rock ledge that just ate it. That's a beautiful peep. Let's go. Boys, we're literally just killing them today. Chill, chill. That's a darker one. That's a really dark one. Look how easy this hook will just fall out of his mouth. Ready? Look at that. You can literally see the hole. Now I just put it there. Alright, 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 alright. I'm gonna get you back in the water, bud. So the bite seems to have slowed down a little bit. Um, not seeing them as much. Um, they're floating this bait for a little bit, so <clears throat> might make a little bit of a move, honestly. But I do want to catch one more out of here, like the one that's on it, this one right now. Yeah, we got a fish on. A little largey. Can't get away from these largemouth bass. Cannot get away from them. Like to see it. I just want to see my line come tight. Oh my god, right as I said that. Literally right as I said that. That feels like a bigger one. Get out of those rocks. Dude, these things Fight. Dude, that's a pretty one. Look at those spots on them. I'm gonna try to let him get all of his last things out of here. Oh boy. That's a nice one. That is such a pretty one, dude. Wow. Hey guys, well, I'm back in the truck now, and it is about 1.30. Uh, I fished that spot for, honestly, about an hour, 15 minutes, and that was crazy. That was probably some of the most favorite, what am I trying to say? That was probably my favorite video that I've done on this channel, just because you had, to, like, you guys can't see it like uh, on the GoPro as well as you can see it in person. That bridge, like where I was crawling, was probably like three feet high. So you're really just hunched over 
going through it's slippery and then you and then you open up to this beautiful canal that is crystal clear and um, you can see these peacock just all around and I had a great time so I hope that you guys really enjoyed the video make sure you guys like and subscribe there will be more videos let me know what you guys want to see because now that I'm down pretty much living in this area for most of the year until I go back home to see family um, just let me know what you guys want to see I will definitely be coming back to this spot this spot actually which I'll show you in a second really just winds around there's a whole the canal system goes all the way through here I just fished the bridge so maybe next time that I come here I'll actually walk the canal um, with the live bait or with this jig here that I bought as you guys can see and try to catch some peacock bass but with that being said, we caught some good fish today. When I say we, when I'm talking to the camera and I'm filming, you guys are right here next to me. You guys are sitting in this seat right here, and you're with me because you guys are clicking on the video. So we caught some good fish today, probably the biggest peacock bass that I've ever caught. Um, and that one hit, that, that one fish that came right up to it and ate it. I'm going to see if I can't put that clip in right here. He's on him. He's got him. He's got him. He's got him. He ate right there. That was crazy. That was absolutely crazy. I had so much fun seeing that and filming that. So let's do it again. Let's do it again soon. When will you guys expect another video? Honestly, probably not tomorrow because tomorrow is Friday and I have an earlier class tomorrow. And then Saturday, I don't fish on the weekends. That is kind of my thing. I do not fish on the weekends just because everybody fishes on the weekends that they have work. So I don't fish on the weekends. And Sunday, Going to a Dolphins game with my dad. Go Dolphins. That's a hard year, but go Dolphins. So probably Monday you'll see another video. I'll cook up some ideas and see what I can think of and hopefully hear back from you guys, whether it's here or on Instagram or whatever, uh, with some more ideas. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys again soon. Thank you so much. Make sure you guys like and subscribe.